Hallelujah. Turn to Nehemiah chapter 4 if you would tonight. Oh, praise God. Praise God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Praise the Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, How many ever feels like that, uh, that the devil has broke you wild down? Anybody ever feel like, you know, that it goes for a time and, uh -huh. and we've got that hedge of protection yeah. for a while around us? Uh -huh. And it just seems like for a time, Brother Jeff, that we're so strong and there ain't, there ain't nothing that the devil can do to get, get into us or, yeah. or to bother us or to cause us. Can I obey the Lord? Amen. 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 Yes, amen. Why don't you all come up here and sit up front. Praise God. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. I feel like ends is a far off from tonight. Praise Jesus. Hallelujah. But does anybody feel like, praise God, that sometimes it just seems like the devil's broke through you wild. Amen. And he's a causing affliction to you. He's able to hit you with those fiery darts, Brother Jim. Yes, amen. Even... Even as so he's even so close that he can throw a rock and hit us, Brother Jeff. I feel like that sometimes, Sister Angel. Sometimes I feel like that I've got a barrier around me that the devil cannot get through. Now, and we're talking about Jerusalem here tonight. God's chosen people. Amen. God's chosen city, yes. Brother Jeff. Praise the Lord. But yet the Babylonian Empire came and they tore the walls down. Amen. They wrecked it. And why did they do that, Brother Jeff? It's because some of God's people got away from God. Amen. And so God allowed the, the enemy to come in. He, he pulled that hedge of protection down, praise God. Amen. And sometimes that's what's wrong with us. The Bible tells us to, praise God, Brother Jeff, to know to do good and do it not. It is sin. Amen. Praise the Lord. So we might not, you know, some uh, sometimes, Brother Jeff, when we get up and we preach the Word, praise the Lord, and, and we try to convey to the people and say, listen, we've got to change our way. Amen. You know, and we'll sit back there when the preacher's up here, you know, and, and we get real mad sometimes, Sister Lenore, and we say, well, that old preacher, he's just saying that I'm just an awful sinner. Well, I may not be an awful sinner in one way, but if I know to do something good, Amen. if I know to do oh, good yeah. for God, if I know to do all yeah. I can for Jesus, yeah. praise yeah. the Lord. Yeah. And when my day comes and my chance comes, Brother Jeff, yeah. that I can do something for the Lord yeah. and I let it slip by me. I'm just the same as a thief and a robber. Yeah. I'm just the same, yeah. praise God, as an adulterer. Yeah. I'm just the same, praise God, as the murderer, yeah. praise God. Yeah. I'm the same as the harlot, praise the yeah. Lord. Yeah. Oh, praise God. Yeah. Because we have let God's the chance we had to do yeah. something for God. See, that's what Jerusalem done. God's chosen people, Brother Jeff. Yeah. Chosen city. Amen. How the holy city. Still yet, the holy city. Mm -hmm. Praise the Lord. Yeah. And the Babylonian Empire came and they wiped them out. Yeah. Carried them off into a strange land. How many sees that going on today? Yeah. Yeah. Amen. We can relate this message, Brother Jeff. Yeah, we can. Not only to our country, we can relate it to our state. Mm -hmm. Not only to our state, we can relate it to our county. Yes, right. Not only to our county, we can relate it to our city. Not only to our city, we can come right down to our community. Praise the Lord. Praise God. Where that God's people, praise the Lord, we know to do, to do good, Amen. but we do it not. Praise yes. the Lord. And so in doing that, God removes the hedge. God allows sometimes He takes, pulls the hedge, He pulls the barrier down that He has between us and the devil, us and evil, of, uh, and the powers and the principalities of, of the higher brother Jeff. He pulls it down. He allows us to suffer things. He allows us to go through things. Praise the Lord. But praise God. Ain't you glad that just like Nehemiah, you know what Nehemiah done? He got sad for his country. He got sad for his home. Oh, if Woo, hallelujah. If God's people tonight, church, if we would get sad, Tanya, to go back home, praise the Lord. If we would get sad and go to desire, oh God, I remember. Oh, praise God, Lord. I remember when you had that hedge built up around me, God. I remember when nothing could faze me. I can remember God. Hallelujah. How that when the enemy would come to me, you had a wall in front of me, God. Oh, but something other happened, God. seeking his God because his city was that ruin. His people was in a faraway land. Always oh, into your people tonight in a faraway land. Was they one? Oh, hallelujah. I got some family, Brother Jeff. They was of this holy city at one time. 
you ain't worshiping Jesus, if you ain't worshiping the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost, you're worshiping another God. You're not of the holy city. You're not of Jesus Christ's kingdom. Praise the Lord. And we got some family members, church. We've got some loved ones. We've got some neighbors, praise God. Brother Jeff, praise the Lord, that through this turn down of the hedge, the breaking down of the wall, they've been carried off into a faraway country, praise God. They've been carried off, Brother Jeff, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. And you know how we got to get them back? We've got to get a broken heart and a contract spirit about us, and we got to go back to the prayer. we got to go back and say, God, oh, hallelujah, it's good, Brother Jeff, praise the Lord, that we remember what God has done for us. Us. Hallelujah. We have to say, oh God, oh praise the Lord. I don't want to be in this condition no more. I don't want my family in this condition. I don't want them over there, God, while I'm in the holy city. I want to pray to you, God. I want to bring them back in. Oh, hallelujah. I want them, God, hallelujah, to be with me. I want them to be a worker with me as I am a worker for you. Amen. Hallelujah. Yes. And on them, I... He got to praying. He got to seeking God. He went to the king and he, the king said, What's wrong with you? You look kindly sad now. You know that ain't? Bobby, that's my... Yeah. What I get from it. Mm -hmm. Praise the Lord. Kind of put it in Buchanan County language and speech. But the king said, What's the matter with you, Nehemiah? What's wrong with you? And Nehemiah said, my, the walls are broken down in my home. They lay in ruin and I'm sad about it. I'm telling you, church, praise God. Hallelujah, we got a king. And his name is Jesus, praise the Lord. Yes. Just as Nehemiah prayed to that king, oh, and just as he poured out his heart to that king, yes. you know what he done? He went to talking to that king. And he said, king, I want to go back. I want to go back and see my home. I want to go see what's wrong there. I want to go take a look around. I want to see the things that's wrong. I want to, oh, hallelujah. I hope somebody's getting a hold of this. Praise God. He said, I tell you what I want to do, King. I want to go down there and I want to investigate. I want to walk around that city. I want to see what's torn down. I want to see what I need to do, King, to fix the walls of my home back. I want to see what I need to do, King, to build those walls back. Oh, just as I was, praise the Lord. I'm telling you tonight, praise God. We can lay and we can belly and call we won't. Woo, hallelujah. But we need to get a hold of God. And we need to say, God, oh, hallelujah. Show me, God. Help me to walk around. Oh, hallelujah, the perimeter of this hedge that you have for me and my family, God. Show me, God, where I need to go and what I need to do. Show me, God, if a stone is out of place here. Show me, God, if there's one out of place here. Show me, God, what I need to do. Oh, to repair my wall. Yes. Praise, Praise the Lord. He said, King, let me go down. And you know what the king done? Because Nehemiah had been good in serving that king, brother Jeff. Praise the Lord. That king said, okay, you go down and you see what you need to do. I'm going to give you a pass. I'm going to write a letter. I'm going to put my seal upon it. Mm -hmm. I'm going to sign my name, my John Henry, to it. And anybody you pass along the way, they ain't got no right to bother you because you've got a letter from the king. Yeah. Oh, you go down there, praise the Lord, don't matter where you go, where your feet trod, you've got a pass for me. Yeah. I'm telling you, you've got a pass for me. Yeah. Yeah. Me I, you go down there and you see what your city needs. You see what it's going to take to build your wall up. Amen. And if anybody confronts you and say, why are you doing here? You show them your letter from me. I'm yeah. telling you what tonight, praise God. Oh, glory, hallelujah. You've got a right to go and check out your wall. You've got a right, Tanya, to go to God and say, God, I want the things in my life repaired. I want my family back in the house of the Lord. I want my people worshiping you, God. I want my things laid back up. I want my wall built up, God. Oh, hallelujah. I want all the gates fixed. I don't want the gates tore down, God. I want them fixed so I can close them and keep out the enemy, God. Oh, hallelujah. Not only do you have that right, but 
you've got a right to go through, way through anything to get there. And you've got a pass from God to do it. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, Sister Lenore, when we meet that enemy along our way, I go on, hallelujah, to repair and, and check on our wild road, yeah? And see what we need to do, Sister Angel, when we meet somebody along the way, if they tell us, how many times have you said, you know, I wish so-and-so was in church. And then you've always got this negative person that says, hell freeze over before that happened. Uh -huh. The church would fall down if they ever in there. Yeah. Yeah. We've always got that negative person. Uh -huh. Well, you've got the right to say, hey, listen here, buddy. Uh -huh. Yeah. In the name of Jesus, that's a lie from the devil. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. I'm telling you tonight, Sister Lenore, praise the Lord. You keep praying for them youngins and don't listen to what nobody else tells you. You've got a right to rebuke that. You've got a letter from the King. Hallelujah. Amen. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. Yes. Praise the Lord. Yes. Hallelujah. And so Nehemiah, he went down and he began to build his city back. Praise the Lord. Yeah. Hallelujah, but do you know, praise God, <laughs> that there's a lot of steps getting from where Nehemiah asked, could he go back and build a city? Yeah. <clears throat> and actually getting things done. Yeah. Yeah. He had got a letter from the king, recommendation or whatever you want to call it, Brother Jeff, that he met. If he met it, nobles from other places. Yeah. He had he had his kings. Signet or signature or whatever you want to call it. Mm -hmm. Permission to be there. Permission to be doing that. Yes. But yet, the enemy can't stand it. Yep. When we go to try to build our walls. Amen. Man. Praise the Lord. Nehemiah chapter 4. I'll begin at verse 7. Now all this stuff I done told you about, it's, it's in the past. And now we're at the point where Nehemiah is trying to build that wall back. Yes. It said, and it came to pass <coughs> that when Sanballat and Tobiah and the Arabians and the Ammonites and the